Hi friends, what's so up? This is our K phone 360 reader. It's time to learn how to enable dark mode with focus on iPhone in iOS 16 or later. Focus mode is designed to help you give your best to the thing that matters to you by keeping all the distractions at a fair distance. Times when you are meditating, sweating out in the gym or having a peaceful time, this feature can come in super handy by ensuring random alerts and unnecessary calls do not ruin your time. With iOS 16, the focus mode has become even better and offers plenty of customization including the ability to enable the dark mode. That having said, it's time to learn how to enable dark mode with a focus on iPhone in iOS 16 or later. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. First and foremost, open the settings app on your iPhone and then tap on focus. Now you have to select the desired focus profile for which you want to automatically turn on the dark mode. Next scroll down to the focus filters section and then hit add filter. Under the system filters, hit the dark mode card. Up next, ensure that the dark mode is shown in the appearance selection. After that, make sure to tap on add at the upper right corner of the screen to finish. That's done. Dark mode will now be automatically turned on whenever you activate this focus profile on your iOS device. It's worth pointing out that Apple has already rolled out a focus filter API for developers so that third-party apps can also make the best use of the filtering options. For instance, if you use Snapchat, you can customize it using the available filters like dark mode and low power mode. So it's just a matter of time before you will start seeing a large number of apps competing with each other to make the most of the focus filters. That said, what do you think of this notable iOS 16 feature? Do not forget to share your thoughts in the comments section below. That's all there is to it. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy iPhone and iPad hacks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.